Modern Applications of Molecular Genetics Example 1. Transgenic Organisms A transgenic organism is an organism that contains artificially introduced DNA and other genetic material from an unrelated organism. To create a transgenic, you must go through a seven-step process that includes extracting DNA from cells, amplifying that region of DNA, cutting the DNA into smaller pieces using restriction enzymes, spreading fragments on a gel and organizing them by their size, use a molecular probe to find the fragments that interest you, sequence the DNA, and finally introduce that DNA into another organism. Transgenic organisms are great because they allow scientists to study diseases and study the impact that those diseases have on certain genes. One example of a transgenic is a glowfish. A glowfish is a transgenic zebrafish. It's modified by a green fluorescent protein gene called GFP gene, and it contains DNA from organisms like corals, jellyfish, and sea anemone. Example number two, cloning. A clone is an organism that has genetic information identical to the parent. There are two methods of cloning. The first is nuclear transfer, also known as cell fusion, in which enucleated eggs are fused with embryonic or adult cells and grown into clones. The other method is embryo splitting, also called twinning, in which an egg is fertilized and division begins, then an eight cell embryo is formed and each cell is implanted into different mothers. One example we discussed in class is Dolly the sheep, which is an example of a successful cloning. Dolly lived to be six years old and is now preserved in the National Museum of Scotland. Example three is targeted mutagenesis. Targeted mutagenesis is a way for scientists to change specific genes. And there are two different methods that we'll talk about for that. The first is zinc finger nucleases, ZFNs. Zinc finger nucleases are DNA binding proteins that create double-stranded breaks in specific locations. There are two domains, DNA binding and DNA cleaving. The second method is TALIN, which stands for transcription activator-like effector nuclease. 33 to 35 amino acid repeats and a nuclease that cleaves a strand of DNA, each repeat recognizing a specific nucleotide and binding to it. To summarize, advances in science and molecular genetics give scientists the opportunity to create innovative techniques and discover new methods of understanding diseases that may ultimately save lives.